Hello from YouTube, it's Alex here, back with some more Boom Beach. Now, yes, as you can see, I am on my offensive account this time, but we have a lot of explaining to do. And while I'm explaining stuff, I'm going to go show you a bunch of attacks that I've done on this uh, said offensive account, as, uh, well, I've been partially uh, speaking, clearing my map. Uh, so anyway, what the hell do I, am, I, am I doing on the offensive account, as it's been such a long time since then? Well... As the title of the video, at least, I haven't quite finalised the name yet, but something to this effect. But what do I mean? By, what do I mean? English. What do I mean by three times the boom? Well, I've been stupid enough to create a third account. Yes, I have three Boom Beach accounts now, and because of that, uh, I've had to move uh, things around. I've had to move where, on which device uh, each account is on, if you know what I mean. Um, and to put a long story short, since I'm the mad person who has enough computers to probably fill a small shed uh, at the moment, although uh, <laughs> knowing me, that that collection will probably grow. Uh, but at the moment, I've had to like, move my offensive account onto PC, as you can see here on my main system. Uh, my laptop now, instead of having this account, has my new account, and my phone is now the only device that has my main account. If that makes any sense, so. And something tells me I'm going to actually have to speed these videos up since I'm going to be here for a while because I actually have quite a few attacks to show you and I have a few things just to keep mentioning as well. But anyway, so that that's what I'm on about. I now have a third account. Um, I'm still trying to get up to HQ6 so I can join the task force. So we can actually uh, and you can actually see it because uh, at the moment, unless I actually decided to haul out my computer, turn it on, and suss some software out to get it to work or whatever. I mean, I mean, have recording software, but you know what I mean. It's not quite ready yet, and uh, still got a little ways to go. But um, now you want to, you might want to dead, dead English. Um, you might be thinking, well, what is this third account going to be? Because at the moment, I have now one of the. T I mean, I, before this, I had one of the two. Or no, two of the. Uh, you know, no, wait, one of the two. English. I had one of the two main sort of accounts for a specific uh, type of playstyle. Uh, which is my defensive account, as you've seen countless videos on, and now, as you're seeing here, this is my offensive account. So I've now, for the most part, I've experienced both sides of what this game has to offer. A purely ice-ridden, laden, whatever the hell, uh, defensive account, and I now have my straight offense, don't give a crap about victory points, offensive account. So I now have, I have you know, the luxury, because once again, I have many computers, uh, to experience both sides of, of this game, at least, but you know, both thing, both ways to play it, like both of the, like the normal ways to play it. Now, uh, although uh, my friend Edu, being another Task Force member, I th I've already mentioned him before. He is uh, going to be doing another uh, account as well, but this one is of a different thing. Because if you didn't aware, if you weren't aware of this, um, you can. I think if you keep your uh, radar below level two, you will never, you will never get attacked by players. Now, it is possible to do that, of course, but I, I would still consider it a very limiting factor because you won't have Doctor T. You'll have hardly any NPCs and players on your map. Uh, well, you won't have any players. You, you literally just have NPCs. So attacking is just non-existent unless you can get to HQ6 and join a task force. I presume you still can join a task force with. Uh, that low of a, um, a radar, but to prove to prove a point, that's what he's planning of doing is a a base uh, or whatnot without well going to um, radar level two and just ignoring players and not having them on his map, so he can just keep keep all the loot to himself. You, you know, you see what I mean. Really, was this actually six players? Oh, ignore that one. That was uh, that was some um, that was a misclick. Um, did I did I just show you this one? Mm, I might have. Let's just go to this one. I might have, I might have not shown you that one. Uh, anyway, but this uh, the the account the account that I'm now making the third account that's uh, still being built. Like I said, uh, this one is a slightly different way of playing it. Although it's not too un like too different uh, than uh, what Edu's doing. Is he's planning? Well, I'm planning. What am I saying? Uh, of going with uh, fairly low victory points, so it's going to have a little bit of, of the defensive aspect, but 
Uh, I will do what, like, we have a few members on the task force, uh, like Azuka, for example, who's a level 52, I think, but he has only 200 victory points somewhere in there. So he just keeps himself very artificially low on the victory point side, and you can just, you know, because you're so low victory points, you're, the players you're getting ma matched up with are obviously e equally low level, and you can just sit there and accumulate loot pretty much at your own pace, upgrade the literal crap out of everything, without really worrying about players attacking. Now, that's kind of what I'm uh, planning of, but it's a bit different. Um, Although you can't actually, well, I'll tell you the the name of the, uh, the new. Uh, oh yeah, this one's actually has, this one. This place, the, the, this guy has a damage amp. I'm trying to spit English here. So prototype defenses for you. Mind you, my players I've been matched up with are very easy for some reason. Poor base design, I would say. Anyway, I'm getting distracted because I'm like the world's biggest distraction. Um, life's distracting. Um, but no, I've called this third account Captain Life. And if, if you couldn't guess by the name, the idea is I would be, like, low, low victory points like Azuka, but I would collect a metric shit ton of life statues and just get, like, resource production out the wazoo for every type. I'll, I'll, I mean, ultimately speaking, I will have I'll, I would hope to have a masterpiece in, it, in every resource production and maybe even an all-resource production statue. And with the leftover statues, I'll, I'll probably get things like resource reward, because that's the thing. The, you see, the, like, look at these numbers from all these um, attacks here. That is with a 48% resource reward statue, so th this has been a huge help. It's surprising how um, quickly you get used to having an extra resource reward. So, uh, And I, as you can see here, actually here are my stats for tank medic, 54 health and 51 GBE. So that's that. Um, so... It's basically a whole. It's ba it's basically what like some of these high level people are doing. Actually, I have a level 56 on my map with 300 odd victory points. Um, so he's obviously playing quite conservatively. But like I said, just overload on the life statues so I can basically sit there and do what say Azuka does, but just accumulate so much more uh, resources, both in my personal production on the island. Uh, but also in the uh, offensive side, I will probably have like a any leftover statue uh, lo spots that I have uh, on that account. I'll probably put maybe a, you know the odd GBE, um, maybe a PSC statue or Power Stone chance. I don't know, um, but uh, if one time setup wouldn't just keep bugging me, um, that is the idea with that. And I suppose just to finish up here, since I'm actually this is the last attack on my. Uh, uh, list here, that's six attacks later, is um, what, if anyone's going to be wondering if I, what, what else am I going to be doing with, the, uh, with videos and YouTube and stuff, I will, I'm just going to put a, a sort of a warning out there, I'm going to have to get a job soon, so I'm making the most of what time I have to play Boom and to play all these other games and uh, to get videos out there, so i, I got to hope that I don't, I'm literally not so, like, when, when this, when the time comes and I get a job, I'm not going to be so bogged down. I can't even put any videos up. So I do, I do like this YouTube channel. It's, it's something small. I can just talk to the camera, talk to you guys, and you can just, I don't know, <laughs> comment and uh, have an opinion on what I say, because uh, I usually spout crap to myself all the time. So how about I record said instances of spouting crap? and get someone else's opinion, or at least just put it out there to the masses and just see what people say. So, there you go. Um, and actually, let me just show you, here is the stats of my tanks because of the tank medic, and I have a lot of health. Um, I wasn't boosting, actually. If I boosted, I'd, uh, I'd have a lot of health, and uh, I, may as well, I may as well just show you uh, my troops and stuff, because I have not really shown you the offensive account in a long time. And yes, for a level 56, Actually, ignore my warriors, they're low level, but uh, for a level 56, uh, 36 even, um, I've done pretty well with the uh, armory upgrades as uh, I've... I'm actually upgrading... Um, uh, was I upgrading? Perhaps not. Wait, hang on. Did I? Oh, no, I was going to say, I thought I had my um, um, artillery was finished yet, so there you go. And I may as well just quickly show you the statues. So that's that resource ward, like I mentioned. 30 health, which is pretty good. A pretty bad, actually, 24% GB masterpiece, but I've got nothing else better to use. 13% health, 15 and 12 respectively there, and 11% health there. So no damage uh, at the moment, but I'll have to keep searching for a masterpiece when the time arises there. So anyway, I'm going to shut up now, 
And next video, I may I can probably give you a heads up. We'll probably, if I can get this, if I can get this finished within the next couple of days, uh, in the next video will probably be another Subnautica base design video, as I seem to be uh, doing those. And well, <laughs> people seem to like those um, base designs, and it's something a bit different, something not not everyone does. Everyone does let's plays or showcases rather than actual base builds exactly. Anyway, I'm getting off topic, um, and I'll I said I said, hang on, what the hell? Wait, what? That's not right. What have I messed up here? <laughs> I've messed something up. Hang on. Oh, no, wait, that, that was it. That was how it was supposed to be. I don't know. Anyway, I'm going to shut up here. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video.